Hello everyone. Well, I'm Jyotsna back again with my update. As you know, I had undergone a major surgery of my cervical spine. I'm feeling much better. And today I've come back on the screen for a reason. I want to introduce you to my neurosurgeon who has given me second life, a beautiful life ahead now. All my worries, all my pains are going away. All thanks to Dr. Harshpal Singh. He's a Amazing. He's a, he is an amazing neurosurgeon and in he's sitting here, Dr. Singh, thank you so much for whatever you've done for me, honestly. It's my second life. Please introduce yourself once again for people, if they want to benefit from you, they should actually get the right details. <laughs> for sure. Thank you, Justin. My name is Harshpal Singh. I'm a neurosurgeon. I practice in uh, northern New Jersey, I trained in New York City and did specialty training in, in Florida. A lot of what I do is uh, more complicated cases and revisions and fixing uh, some bad cervical and lumbar and thoracic spine problems in addition to doing also cranial surgery. I uh, would love to help anybody who needs it and I tend to be very particular about what I offer surgery for and I was just telling Joyce Mann earlier today is that spine surgery gets a bad name but spine surgery done for the right reasons and indications is extremely effective. And uh, Joyce and I had a, just a, a great recovery, and I knew she would do very well because she had a, a very clear problem, and now it's fixed. And uh, that's the, the best part of our job. We like to help people and get them back to uh, back to living life. So. Just uh, uh, give a little bit detail about me as well when I came to you, so that people will be able to relate. And what was my condition? Sure, sure. So in your in uh, Joyce's cervical spine, she had disc herniations, and these were compressing the spinal cord as well as the nerves that leave the cervical spine and go to the body. These nerves are responsible for making your arms move, sensation, walking, balance, and also you can get significant headaches from muscle spasms and radiating pain. So she had a very, very clear picture of compression of her spinal cord and nerve roots, but, and those nerve roots and the spinal cord don't heal unless you take the pressure off. It's very similar to having somebody squeeze your arm. If I squeeze your arm and I continue to hold the arm, this is eventually going to turn black, tingle, and the tissue is going to die. So the only way to make this better is to relieve the pressure. And that's what we did for, for the cervical spine. And clearly she's done, done quite well postoperatively and it's what we expected. But, you know, again, she had clear indications, clear structural problems, and, and she's going to do very well and for the rest of her life. And now I'm going for my physical therapy for a couple of months and I'll be back to only because of this wonderful, uh, you know, doctor here. And my, in fact, I would say he's God to me. I had lost hope, a lot of things in my life. And I'm seeing a ray of hope, a silver lining here. And Dr. Paul, thank you so much. Everything. Where can people contact you? You can contact me. I'm at uh, Premier Brain and Spine. Uh, our number is 1 866 590 0601. Please uh, call, and I would love to see you and have an opportunity to uh, provide you good care. Thank you so much, Doctor. Right. Appreciate it. Was it? Anyone who's looking for the right solution for their problem with the spine, you have the solution now. Wishing you all great life, happy life. Thank you.